As we inch closer to the NFL season, hopefully at least, who are some names on the Dolphins that opposing teams should know that they probably don't? And who just in specific is the most underrated player on our team? Well, since we were only 5-11 last year and we obviously didn't garner much attention, frankly every good player we have is kind of underrated. But key names to me are players like Preston Williams, he had a number one wide receiver type season before he got injured in week 9. Raekwon McMillan has actually been playing very well for us, not many people have probably noticed, but him and Jerome Baker have been a very good linebacker duo, and now we're getting that trio with Kyle Van Noy. And Eric Rowe, after moving from corner to safety, actually played very well. But who, in my opinion, just is the most underrated player on our current roster? And by the way, I'm only going with players we've already seen play. We don't know if the rookies are underrated or overrated yet. But anyway, to be honest, I'm kind of going with my man Mike Gesicki. I, he still doesn't get that much attention, and I feel like he deserves a little bit more from it. The only thing he struggles with is blocking, but we all knew that. We knew that heading into his rookie year. They didn't draft him for that, though. They drafted him for his athleticism, and jeez does he have that. He might not have delivered much in his rookie season, as most rookie tight ends don't, but in year two? I mean, come on, you're telling me that isn't impressive, all the stuff he's done? Why isn't he in the conversation of being one of the top tight ends in the league, at least athletically? Like, I feel like him and George Kittle are the most athletically gifted tight ends in the league. Hopefully he does better in year three, which I think he can and I think he will actually. If that's the case, then maybe people will start to recognize him a little bit more.